Okay, hi everybody, it's Bonkai922. It's time for... Episode 1 was last week. Kami got killed. Or Kami got killed. Um, episode 2. Kill the Authority. Overall, this was a good episode. This was actually a very good episode... I mean, last week I gave it a high rating because it was the first episode. And, uh. But what I liked about this episode... Now, obviously, the characters... Beginning, basically, basically, what they did in this episode was they combined Chapter 2 and Chapter 3. Chapter 2 is called, um, I believe, Kill the Country. And Chapter 3 is called Kill the Authority. Now, you know, they, they showed Tatsumi in the beginning and he, his friends, Graves, and, and all that jazz. And he gets basically introduced to Night Raid. And obviously they changed the names. I, I don't give a shit. I'm calling um, Robok. Robok. Um... I don't care if they change this guy's name. I'm going to call him Brock. Simple as that. We're going to basically get introduced to them. We got Brock, Robach, um, Leone. Well, Leone is very known. Mean. Shears. Um, I thought, and, 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 and for what I like the most about this episode... How they handled the canon material. Respected with the manga. Because, I mean, because you're talking about two chapters in one episode. And that is very difficult to do. But they were able to pull it off very nicely. With only, not, and I, I know this would be spoilers for the anime only watchers. So I'm not going to tell you exactly what they cut out. But what they cut out, it really wasn't necessary. It was okay to cut that out. It's not... It. It's one thing that happens, a, a, a battle, I guess you can call it, and it's not necessary. It's not... It can be left out. And then, you know, we had that, and then basically, it's just basically um, that whole thing. The introduction, chapter two, just, you know, and we have that, and then we go into um, the mission that, uh, and then basically it's training. Talks to me. He's getting trained and everything. Um, cooking and everything, and during this training method, he's actually getting trained by them to kill, be able to, to assassinate people, and that's when we get to the part which I thought was really important to show. Tatsumi up against Ogre. And to Jesse, I'll say this. Yeah, I saw her. I saw you talking about. Fuck her. Yes, I don't like her. I don't like cute justice. No. 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 And people who are wondering what I'm talking about. In the episode, when I think, I don't think it's Leone. I think it's, um... Oh, Nagenda 2 we got introduced as well in this episode. Pretty good. Force is pretty good. Um, I, I liked how, how she was presented. And animated as well. But Nagenda or Leone is telling Katatsumi about Ogre. And that he has like a, a escort of, of, of soldiers that are around him. And one of the soldiers that are escort, that's escorting her with him. As he's walking down the street, is a character who we're going to see later on. Now, I'm not going to say who it was, but Jesse, he has this big thing about cute justice, this, this character, with this character. But uh, I'm not going to tell you who it is, but she was briefly shown. Now, also, in this ep also we find out that they're going after not only Ogre, but this other guy through this woman. Who lost her fiance from you know so and so forth, 
And they basically go after... Now, how they handle this, I must say, White Fox, stand up and give yourself a nice applause because I don't know if anyone who did their reviews mentioned this. I'm going to mention it. I think they might have done a better job than the manga did. And you're probably wondering, what do you mean, Bonkai? Well, during the fight with, with, with you know, you know, we, we have um, Leone and Kami, they take care of their guy quick. And what happens is, <clears throat> Tatsumi confronts Ogre, the demon, and he like, he brings up, let me, let me the, the, the Imperial Capital. And like, he fools him and he, he cuts him on the side. During that exchange. And he thinks he's beating him. And he just walks away. And he's like, oh yeah, I have to report it. And he's like, and, and so on and so forth. And then all of a sudden behind him, here comes Ogre again. And he tries to hit Tatsumi. Very, animated very beautifully. This fight especially. I loved how they did this. And he gets hit, you know, he gets pushed back. And he, and he starts attacking Tatsumi and shit, throwing him around. And, and there's that one part when he's going on about, yeah, I'm going to get to sit the, 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 her, her family and cut them and kill them in front of her one by one and shit, you know. Same bullshit, evil, dickwad uh, epilogue. And Tatsumi got these eyes in his eye. He has these eyes. And he just <laughs> jumps up. Cuts the guy's arms off. The ogre's arms off. And he's got this look in his eye. And he goes in. And they do that thing again. With the... Um, paintbrush thing. You know? I mean, it's not... I prefer... I will say this. I prefer... That... To... The way ghouls... And JoJo, how they handle censorship. I prefer that. If it is, but it's not really censorship. But they show it him slicing him in half, you know, and the blood's coming out, just like in the manga, but it's paintbrushed kind of thing. And when the fight ends, they show you in front of Ogre with the blood splitting out. And I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa. I had to stop for a minute. I had to stop, because I'm thinking, wait a minute, the manga, all you get, because in the manga, it's not the same way. So, I felt like, did the anime add that? Here's what I have to say about it, though. I clapped my hands, yes, because I thought... That was done really well. That was done really well. Surprisingly. I thought that was done great. Now, but overall, yeah, great episode. I'm just... That fight was done very nicely. I wasn't expecting... I wasn't expecting that. The way they did it that way. Um, and such. And they did a good job. I, I'm impressed. But for this, for this, definitely four, four and a half out of five for this episode. I wonder how they're going to go about this. Because after that, after that scene, we have, you know, the scene where uh, uh, he comes back and Akame addresses him. And then she's like, she's like, thank goodness. And then she's got this, the cutesy face on. And I'm like, oh. Because she says that, you know, there are people who've been hurt and they were poisoned and he died. You know, and I, but I need to say another thing about about the show. Kudos to Akame's voice actor. However, the one who does who does Akame, fantastic job. The fact that she can go from One Week Friends to Akame Got Kill, Kiro is is phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal. But this was a very good episode. I highly enjoyed it. Also, now he's going to get trained by Mead. Mead. Uh, her, her voice actors, it's like kind of like, you know, it's like really obnoxious. 
but it fits her. I can't wait until later on. Should be interesting. But this was done very well. I'm 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 impressed with White Fox. The only drawback, the only drawback is when they do this thing when the character the evil characters have those sadistic faces. They have the demonic, you know, voice. That could have been... I mean, I'm guessing I'm guessing the reason why... Could have been two reasons why they're going about like that. Is because, number one, they don't have the budget to animate that part. Or they are just saying, you know, don't want to do it that way. I don't mind it. It's, a, it's an interesting way... But still, frames is is kind of like, you know. But besides that, they're doing a very good job. I think this is a very good job. They're doing very well. Um, I'm not gonna spoil anything here, but by the way they're going, if they're going, if they're going to go from here on out, so like, because in the next episode is called "Kill the Care." Next episode's called Kill the Care. And this was Kill the Authority. And I already know what chapter that is. Now, if this is the way they're going to go about it, at this pace, I don't mind it. I don't mind it. And I just looked on Anime News Network, I think it said 24 episodes. I wonder if that's going to, that's the actual number, episode number. If it is 24 episodes, I really don't mind it. Now, we'll see, though. We'll see. I mean, you got to wonder, because if they do this again, where they merge two more up, two chapters together, and they push further in, I want to at least see them try to get up to, like, past chapter 30. If they can get past chapter 30, I think I think I'll be happy. But at the same time, maybe it's best that they don't. But, you know, we'll see. So far, I love it. Love it. They did a good job with this. Um, nothing else to be said, pretty much. Uh, and kudos to Tatsumi killing the fuck out of Vogar, yo. That that was that was pretty boss. That was pretty boss. That was pretty boss. That was pretty boss. I really enjoyed that. So, yeah. Bonkai 922. I'll see you guys later. Um, there's a tag video going around. Believe me. Yeah, there is. Apparently. <laughs> um, Luffy the Super Saiyan. Jojo Pose. Tag video. Uh, I won't do that now. I'll probably do that later today. You can look forward to that. I'm Bonkai 922. I'll see you guys later. Tatsumi, yo, he had that look in his eyes. I'm gonna, I don't give any fucks. I'm gonna kill ya. That was awesome. I'll see you guys later.